will be about the challenges encountered in the mobile money transactions. And on page 15, the committee recommends that the Bank of Uganda and UCC, the regulator, should carry out a comprehensive fraud awareness and prevention programs in the form of trainings, media campaigns, and safeguards to prevent the, comp the compromising of personal identification numbers to sensitize co consumers, staff, and agents. The committee also recommends product risk assessment should be incorporated into every mobile money service management program. The committee recommends Bank of Uganda and UCC should strengthen compliance, monitoring, management programs in order to ensure top-to-bottom compliance with the established procedures to reduce internal and external fraud risk. The committee further recommends UCC liaising with the law of enforcement agencies in investigation and prosecution of fraud. On the area of regulation of mobile money, the committee recommends that government enforces the National Payments Act 2020 as enacted. More sensitization is made to the public about the procedures for the beneficiaries to access the money on mobile money account of the deceased subscribers. In the area of income streams, the committee recommends that the central bank comes up with a policy that will provide for you for uniformity while determining the rates that the communication companies charge the customers while providing the different services. Consumer protection, the committee recommends that mobile money providers establish a system that issues automatic receipts to customers in real time to improve on the security of mobile money transaction since the receipts can capture actual details of each transaction. UCC and mobile money providers undertake massive awareness campaigns of the rights and obligations of the subscribers. 